there is a minimally moderately hypokagenic nodule in the central part of the right lobe. The lesion presents cystic areas and nonspecific hyperkagenic granules. The nodule increased slowly over the past several years. The lesions is surrounded with halo and displays a combined type 2 and type 3 vascular pattern. The presence of intranodular flow corresponds to intact, regenerated tissue. We locate the needle in the central field of vision. The tip of the needle is not visible. While starting with the injection a hyperkagenic mass appears in the dorsal part of the lesion. In order to avoid extranodular injection we corrected the location of the needle. Now, the tip of the needle is in the central part of the nodule and we can perform the procedure safely. We treated the ventral and central part of the nodule. Second session is presented now. The echo structure of the nodule has not changed. This time we targeted a more dorsal portion of the lesion. The dorsal border of the nodule is hard to identify, therefore we must be careful not to inject the ethanol extranodular. We follow with the third session. The echo structure of the nodule has changed, it became more hypokagenic and inhomogeneous.